<laughs> but we have something more really exciting. This is something uh, PJ has been wanting to do, I think, for a very long time. And yeah. it's, it's like we, well, it's a throwback kind of thing for you guys TBT. to reminisce, right, of your time. So before we start, we can introduce, oh, you guys can introduce yourself from who do you want to go? Shortest to, or darkest to lightest? <laughs> wow. Darkest to lightest. Yes. Yeah. Darkest, darkest to lightest. <laughs> hey, come on, man. Hey. <laughs> Everyone okay. sees this. Yeah. Everyone sees this. Yo, I was dark when it's I was It's consensus, so PJ is going to start because he's the darkest. Okay. Um, what do I say about myself? Yeah, PJ, um, these guys were PCP, uh, Pinoy Canadian Prospects. We were the first batch that went to the Philippines. You know, a bunch of prospects, a bunch of uh, really good players in our own respective teams. We went back, did like a full-on school tour. How many schools did we do? I don't even remember. Uh, like at least 15. 15 schools we visited. At least we, we had played. Just, I think we had like 23 games, but I think it might have been 13 to 15 oh, schools yeah. or something like that. Yeah, was there, and these guys were my, you know, my soldiers. In introduce yes. yourselves before we can. Uh, PJ, go through, my we're name getting... PJ, man. PJ, you know me. To the second darkest. My name's Adrian. Adrian. And the lightest, because I'm half. I'm mixed. I'm top and bottom. <laughs> what do we call that in the Philippines? Mestizo or Mestizo? Yeah, 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 Mestizo. Mestizo. Oh, you can just call it Mestizo. Oh, That's yeah, all good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. My name is Mestizo, Mestizo, a.k.a. Julian, <laughs> a.k.a. <laughs> nah, no, that's all I got. <laughs> okay, the shooter in the squad. The shooter in the squad. Back in the day. Ah. I'm a three-point specialist. So you guys mm -hmm. were in the, how long were you guys in, when you, for the PCB program, how long were you guys in the Philippines? Is that? Um, oh, three, three weeks, weeks, about three, three weeks. weeks yeah. right? Three and weeks. then you guys like literally played basketball every day, or is that? Yeah, yeah for sure, every day. Wow. It was very well planned. Yeah. It was yeah. very well planned. Very well like, organized. It's either we were on a tour visiting the school, or we had like a game right away. Julian's so, dad like, really hooked it up. Mm, like, yeah. he's the one who organized everything, and like yeah. literally every day we were doing something. Yeah. If we were off, we had something planned to do together. So it was, wow. it was good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. How did you guys? I guess like from before you guys went to the Philippines, how did it all start? How did you guys got into the program? How did you guys got into the team? Like, how did it all? That's a good question. Honestly, I don't know. Did your dad start it? Uh, kind no of. Um, well, there was like a mix between some of the old teams that we were a part of because. Some of the team was Warriors, but mm. some of them... Yeah, uh, Patrick was never I was not even team. Warriors. I was, yeah. just, like, I was a walk-on. Walk yeah, this, this was back in the days, though, yeah. but everybody yeah. knew each other because yeah. of, um, what was it, FIBA? Mm -hmm. and the league. Filipino League, yeah. yeah. And then yeah. we, I think there was also, like, uh, an ad in the Filipino newspaper. You remember what that was called? Oh, shoot. Oh, I, don't I don't remember, remember what it was called, but there were open tryouts as well. Oh, okay. yeah. So you guys all tried out? or yeah. you, and you yeah. Yeah. We all tried out. We all yeah. made it, and... Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, did man. Thing, and then happily ever after, we yeah. went to the Philippines and... How did you guys feel like when you guys were... Was that your first time going to the Philippines and that oh, first? Shoot. Or was that... Not my first... Not, it wasn't my first time, yeah. but it was yeah. first time playing Play. ball. Uh -huh. And that was yeah. intense. But it was my first time kind of like just chilling in Manila. Yeah. My family's from like the provinces, so like literally as soon as you land... You're you just went through. Mm. Oh man, how did it feel though on your first time saying, "Hey, I, I'm here to play basketball." Like, were you like, "Oh, you don't want to yeah. ask us about our first oh, day?" Oh, that was a bad. Was like, <laughs> man, I, I was sweating like the first was, like. Yeah, how it was, was fun. fun. I was not, I was not sweating out of nervous. Or sweating no, no, like you so were just no. like, this is no, the story. No. We, okay. Some of us landed the night before, okay, and some of us landed the day of our game. <laughs> yeah. <It's>, so how <laughs> yeah. wait, so like, was oh, it was starting by like hey you just playing now you just yeah. got in yeah like, so like literally like some of us literally just rolled up that morning yeah and we, we all met like, up in luggage the, in the like we had luggage in no we didn't have no. luggage off the court no. but almost it was pretty close some but, of us yeah. probably yeah jr came that one time right before the game started Remember? Oh, yeah, 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 I remember. Oh. Yeah, so, like, literally, like, I can't lie, that was probably the most disgusting loss of the whole, like, <laughs> yeah. trip. And we lost to them yeah. twice disgustingly. Yeah. You forget. We faced them again. I don't was, know, it was, was that gym. It was no, 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 but it was a different different team. It was A team and B team. Was it San Beda? Yeah. Okay. What was it? We just better, better, better. And we played in their gym, but their yeah. gym had no AC. Yeah. So you guys were just like... Yo, they set us up for failure. They knew <laughs> they, they were like, they, yeah, knew. Canadians. No, they, they knew that you guys yeah. couldn't stand the heat as much. They as they could. Terrible. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Just warming up, yeah. you're already sweating buckets. Not even boring. warming up. We were, we were not even warming up. We were stretching yeah. and we were sweating <laughs> we were done. It was The humidity yeah. was crazy. Yeah. And this was at night. The, yeah. For the first ones I got there, it was at night. Stretching, wow. already sweating buckets. It was pretty intense, man. Oh. Mm. What did you guys feel like the difference was playing playing here in Canada, playing ball here, and playing oh, back there? Style. What was the difference in the game or the the Style. kind of players? It, it's a play? lot more fast paced. Yeah. Like, fast. 
as soon as someone touches the ball, they're pedal they're to bowling, the metal. They're running through through the court. whole mm-hmm. game, pedal to the metal. Wow. If you slow down, you're left yeah. behind. They're yeah. quick. You gotta be very conditioned. They're quick. You gotta be How was the physicality? Was it there? Was it more like hand they're check? Physical, more? They're really yeah. physical. They're physical. Like I had guys. Yeah. Like I was a pre- I was this size. Like yeah. when I went there. Yeah. And I was a pretty big guy already. Yeah. And I had guys who I was like, yeah, I can take this guy. Yeah. Literally, like, stepped in the post, gave me a nice elbow to the chest. I was like, yeah. <gasps> like you know, like, yeah. and I was a yeah. big dude already. So I was yeah. like, you know, like, I actually had to prepare myself mentally. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Every time, like, I was stepping up, even if they didn't look like they could play ball, they could play ball. Uh, yeah, definitely don't underestimate them. Yeah. They're hungry. Yeah. yeah. That's the key that's thing. The They're thing, hungry. Yeah. Key thing, yeah. They're hungry. Because that's that's kind of like the only way out. Some of them. Yeah. Like yeah. they have to play in order to, you know, go to school. Some of them are pulled from the province and like yeah. they were farm boys and like yeah. they were yeah. Built like a farm boy, like you know what I mean. Yeah. Like, conditioned, yeah, right? They were yeah, conditioned, yeah. Yeah. so yeah. they they were strong. Oh wow! Yeah. They're in their natural element too. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, that's true. And they're in the natural element of being like in the humidity and everything. For them, that's just normal. That's normal. You know what I mean? yeah. Yeah. Oh, For man. us, like that was that was like running in a sauna. Like it was. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, I can see that. Like, yeah. Like, and when you're playing like a set game too, it's a lot different. Different. Like yeah. you you pace yourself, right? Yeah. But then you have the shot clock, which you know you don't have. It doesn't get introduced until later. Yeah, yeah. we didn't have that. High we school. didn't know. No. But then you go into the shot clock. You go into a fast-paced game. You're trying to slow things down. You can't. You, can't, you know, because yeah. they're on you, man to man, all the time. Like I don't yeah. I don't remember them playing zone really that much. No, Maybe no, rarely. No. A lot, a lot of, of things nice. too is like they had a lot of drummers. Yeah. Remember that? Yeah, they had a lot of oh, the spirit. Yeah. The spirit. Yeah. So was the energy was there, yeah. 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 energy was yeah. insane. So oh, we walked into gyms and it was full. Yeah. Like it feels to me that you crazy. guys like literally had a lot of you know learning experience and a lot of you know just chemistry and bonding that you guys went through no, for that whole three weeks. Mm-hmm. Right? Yeah. What do like, you guys feel like though? That's like some of the key things that you guys kind of experienced together. So if you guys can put it in like. A one minute highlight just oh, telling man, all the things so that much, you guys man. learned from each other, all the things that you guys took from Yo, that to now. We, okay. we built a bond like no other. Like, yeah. Yeah. till now, weeks, like, but... PCP was probably the best experience. Yeah. yeah. I yeah. went to the Philippines and actually played ball down there. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Until now, like, PCP itself, like, that whole trip yeah. was one of the best yeah. experiences of like, yeah. my whole life. Yeah, because yeah, PG mentioned to me that you guys go out like once a year to do something together. Yeah, yeah. 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 reunion. Yeah. 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 Bowling. Well, it was what, eight years ago yeah. now, wasn't it? Or close Long to time. PCP? Yeah, it was a, yeah. It was a while back. 2008. Yeah. But uh, yeah. but still, like it was three weeks of intensity. Like we obviously practiced like a long time before that, but yeah. those three weeks, it like it goes really fast. Yeah, and so. like you, you could only imagine like there's what how many of us were on ten? Ten. ten there's ten of us, and we literally spent almost every part of the day together. Like yeah. we went to practice together, we woke up together, we went to the mall, grabbed some food together, we ate the same food. Like it was like. It was an insane trip. It was crazy. It was like a tour, basically. It, it was. was like we were, it was like a mini experience of professional basketball. It was, and then you you just dipped into this completely different culture, yeah. and like, it was insane. It was, like, we might be Filipino, but we were most of us were raised here, right? Yeah, so. Canadian. No, I could see that, yeah. and I, I, it's it's good to see that something like that could happen in like in terms of people, uh, you know, Filipino Canadian wanting to play basketball and going to the Philippines, and it's great to hear your story because I'm pretty sure a lot of People, a lot of kids that are watching our show want to play basketball, not just me, maybe to play in, go in the Philippines or go into Europe or go and play maybe in leagues here, right? So it's great to hear that from you guys. I know you guys have a video, but you, uh-huh. you, you guys have, have such a great it. story. You just have to link <laughs> it on our saying. Facebook. Um, we're going to put it on our <laughs> Facebook link. So you guys can see the video of you know the kind of story because there's more to what you guys went through and I can yeah, see that you yeah. guys have so much stories. Might have to be back on the show. Because <laughs> <laughs> oh, I wanted to go through the video, but you guys had such good stories and it's okay. coming from all these like rich memories that you guys uh, are yep. coming up and stories. And I wanted to go through more of that. So the video will be posted in our link in our Facebook, mm-hmm. Crossover FTV. But that was great. It was really good to hear from you guys. <laughs> <laughs>